Ever thought you could repair your iPhone with used parts? No, we're not talking about the duct tape and super glue hack you tried last time. This is legit. Apple has announced it will support iPhone repairs with used parts for select models starting this fall. Yes, you heard it right. You can now officially become a tech wizard, Frankensteining your iPhone back to life. So, what's on the menu? Screens, batteries, and biometric sensors. Apple maintains that parts pairing is essential for privacy and security. It's like matchmaking for iPhone components. You can't just throw any screen on your iPhone, it's got to be a perfect match. And it seems Apple is playing Cupid here, expanding iPhone activation lock capabilities to individual components to prevent theft. It's like having a bouncer for each part of your iPhone, and we're not talking about the kind that can be bribed with a $20 note. But wait, there's more. Not everyone is thrilled about this. Critics are calling it obfuscation. Well, they can call it a purple elephant for all we care. What matters is that this shift is seen as a response to the growing right to repair movement. It's like Apple is saying, fine, you can fix your phone, but we're still gonna make it a little tricky for you. States like Oregon have passed laws to ban parts pairing. It's like they're playing hard to get with Apple. And Apple's decision? It's seen as a response to this changing legislative landscape and pressure from advocates for the right to repair. So, what do you make of all this? Are you ready to bring out your inner tech wizard and start repairing your iPhone with used parts? Or maybe you're one of the critics, seeing this as just another way for Apple to control how we use our devices. Either way, we'd love to hear your thoughts. So go ahead, dive into the comments section and let us know what you think about Apple's decision. Remember, no opinion is too small or too crazy for us to hear. After all, this is the internet, where even a cat playing a piano can become a sensation overnight. So don't hold back, let your thoughts flow. And hey, while you're at it, feel free to share this video with your friends. Let them in on the conversation too. Until next time, keep those iPhones ticking and those comments coming.